We're learning more tonight about the man accused of kidnapping a Chinese scholar at the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign. CBS 2's Sandra Torres is live in the newsroom with more on the investigation. Sandra. Well, my investigators believe Ying Ying Zhang is dead, but so far only charged 28 year old Brent Christensen with kidnapping. Our CBS affiliate in Champaign reports that he's a former grad student from the University of Illinois who once worked as a teacher's assistant. And the news came as a shock to many who followed this case closely here in Chicago. Flyers with pictures of Ying Ying Zhang are still visible around Chicago's Chinatown. A community that stepped in to help the family of the Chinese scholar who went missing on June 9th. I did all I could. Dr. Kim T was behind the effort. He's been in touch with the Zhang family since they arrived in the U.S. I could not sleep at all last night. That's because last night the FBI announced they arrested 28 year old Brent Christensen, a former graduate student from the University of Illinois who now faces kidnapping charges. The entire community is more sorrow about what happened about this case because uh, with the detailed description from the FBI and the entire community is in shock. Surveillance video shows Zhang gotten to the front seat of Christensen's black Saturn near the university campus. The FBI now says they have audio of Christensen describing how he kidnapped her and cell phone records show he visited websites to plan a kidnapping. Authorities believe Zhang is no longer alive. The family, I don't think they are accepting it because there's still the chance that they are slightly hopeful. They will not leave until they find her. And the FBI has not said where Zing's body may be. And in the meantime, Christensen is scheduled to be back in court on Monday. Live in the newsroom, Sandra Torres, CBS 2 News. My. Thank you, Sandra.